subscribe and download over 1 million code snippet including this tutorial from codegive.com, link in the description below. Title, A Beginner's Guide to Keyboard Input in Python Introduction Python provides a simple and efficient way to handle keyboard input in your programs. In this tutorial, we will explore the basics of keyboard input using the input, function and the keyboard library. Whether you're building a console-based application or just want to receive user input, understanding how to work with keyboard input in Python is a valuable skill. The input function is a built-in function in Python that allows you to take user input from the keyboard. It reads a line from the user and returns it as a string. Here's a basic example. In this example, the input function takes a prompt as an argument, displays it to the user, and waits for them to enter something. The entered value is then stored in the variable user underscore input and printed to the console. If you need to receive numerical input, you can use the int or float functions to convert the input to an integer or a float, respectively. Here's an example. In this example, the user is prompted to enter their age. The int function is used to convert the input to an integer, allowing us to perform arithmetic operations with it. For more advanced keyboard input handling, you can use the keyboard library. To install it, you can use the following command. Now, let's look at a simple example using the keyboard library to detect key presses. In this example, the program continuously checks if the Q key is pressed using keyboard dot is underscore pressed. When the Q key is detected, the program prints a message and exits the loop. Understanding how to handle keyboard input in Python is essential for building interactive programs. Whether you're creating games, command line tools, or other applications, these examples should give you a solid foundation for working with keyboard input in Python. ChatGPT Certainly. Let's create a simple tutorial on how to use keyboard input in Python. For this tutorial, We'll use the input function, which allows users to enter data from the keyboard. In Python, you can easily take input from the keyboard using the input function. This function allows the user to enter data interactively. In this tutorial, we'll explore how to use keyboard input in Python with examples. Let's start with a basic example. Open your Python interpreter or create a new script file, example keyboard underscore input dot py and enter the following code. Run the script and observe that it prompts the user to enter something. After entering a value, the script prints the entered value. If you expect numeric input, you can convert the input to a numeric type, example int or float. Here's an example. In this example, the input is converted to an integer using int. You can use float for floating point numbers. You can also take multiple inputs on the same line. For instance, this example uses the split function to separate the entered values, assuming they are separated by a space. For password like input, you may want to hide the entered characters. You can achieve this by using a library called getPass. The getPass.getPass function hides the characters as they are typed. In this tutorial, we covered the basics of using keyboard input in Python. The input function is versatile and can be used for various types of user interactions. Depending on your needs, you can further enhance input handling in Python. Feel free to experiment with these examples and adapt them to your specific use cases. ChatGPT